This <laughs> fuck. <laughs> what is happening here? Dude. Oh no! <laughs> Captain, I melt. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So we just got back from a, a an amazing mission, aka the opening credits. Dude, honestly, the saving of Helios One was dope. <laughs> <laughs> I am so fucking amped <laughs> from that saving we did. Yeah, you're welcome, Vulcan you know, race. After the destruction of Vulcan, we have been searching for a suitable planet to rebuild our race. That was some Vulcan aggressive typing she went into. However, <laughs> a project of this magnitude would have taken generations oh, shit. to complete. In order and to here's another opportunity to show off the art from the level you just played. Called the Helios machine. Your station was to harness the energy from the binary stars to power the Helios uh, machine. She knows what her own mission was. Yeah, hey, bo <laughs> stop mansplaining, Spock. Power to our station was shut off. Without power, our station could not withstand the gravitational pull of the stars. Time for our next mission, which it sounded like was go get a thing and blow up a thing, maybe. Done. And Spock being a dick, telling this person her own frickin' research. <laughs> Mansplaining. Everybody in. Ugh, we just have to wait. I like how they get kind of closer, like, oh shit, and they just kind of run in. They always put her in the front, every time. Chekhov, tell me something. It is highly unusual, sir, but I believe My it's God, Chekhov, were you in a fist fight? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> My eyes are so puffy, I don't know what to do. It appears to be a shortcut through space. Where does it lead? There is no way to know for sure, Commander. I believe that rip is the reason my father ordered the Helios machine to be shut down. Then we need to talk to him right away. Lieutenant Uhura, hail new Vulcan. Aye, Captain. It is no use, Captain. We lost communication with them when the Helios machine was shut down. Captain, scans indicate the rip is contracting. At the current rate, it will be gone in approximately 12 hours. Well, back us the fuck off. We have to deal with it better. Captain, no response to our hails. Mr. Sulu, bring us in range of new Vulcan. We're going down there. Oh. And that's the... That's all the time I get to spend on the bridge. I want to see how Sulu's doing. Yeah, it is pretty nervous back there, sir. Wasn't sure if you guys were going to make it. <laughs> you say that every nice time. Nice flying, Sulu. Thank you, sir. Sulu, when we're done here, you owe me a rematch. Your fencing's getting better, sir. Whoa. You almost make Mr. Chekhov. Any life signs? <laughs> he just cut them off. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, <laughs> shut up, Sulu. What's happening on the planet? <laughs> Keep trying. Aurora, what can you tell me? New Vulcan is not responding to hails either, sir. Stay on it. Stay on it. Just stare vacantly at that panel. Do nothing. Don't <laughs> try. Like in Galaxy Quest. I'm doing my job. <laughs> yeah. Everyone, get in. <laughs> I must request permission to join you, Captain. Spock, are you sure that's within protocol? I mean, maybe we should just send Scotty and some recruits. Captain, I hope the importance oh, of the throwing it back in your face, Spock. Mm -hmm. Our people cannot afford another tragedy. This planet is the best hope for our race to prosper. Noted. Then you should also note that having a Vulcan mm -hmm. as a mm -hmm. member of your away team would be yeah. essential. She's probably hot mission. for Spock, right? And I am the only one on this ship that has ever been on the surface of New Vulcan or has experience with the Helios. Right, Are you still right, talking? Right. Don't just run off Great. like that. Now there's two of you guys driving me nuts. What are you doing? What are you doing there? Like, did you think I wouldn't see that you were doing literally nothing here? <laughs> oh, I'm just uh, looking at this ladder. Reading some, doing some readings. He's like, boop, 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 Scotty, one to eject out of the cargo <laughs> hold. <laughs> Looks like Ensign Jenkins isn't doing shit. I'm just gonna wave this firearm around. You know, without hearing what they're saying, it sounds like they're just trying to beat the shit out of Scotty right now. It's like they're backing him into a corner and just taking his shit. I'm Scottish though, I'll take all three of you. All right. Oh, it's the Star Trek moment. Yeah, it is. I'm a uh, big fan of the new uh, transporter special effects. Yeah, I liked that. I gotta say, ever oh, since shit. that thing hit the internet, oh, we didn't. Oh yeah, I guess they kind of, kind of beamed in. 
I uh, remember hearing about that thing that Any made the rounds on the internet that I think we've all Sorry, sir. Too much that we've all heard before. We're like transporting in this is not like moving you from one place to another. It's like taking your atoms and destroying you and rebuilding you somewhere else and like it's a different captain. person and all that stuff. So like, right, are they actually dead? Yeah. Get off. Wow. Dinosaur yeah. hunter. Wow. Oh. All right, that's just rude. <laughs> She's like, sunk, 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 sunk. I've got my phaser proton briefs on. For some reason, the highest security protocols have been enabled on this door. Can we hack it? Yeah, but I can just hold E to hack. We'll to work so. To oh shit. Oh, this isn't love making. I don't know what it is. So, <laughs> Spock, I need your help. I don't know what Spock did to help there. I have zero idea what he even did. Pretty sure he did nothing. Captain, the system seemed to have been purposely shut down. I can provide Spock assistance. hacked it on his own, just based operator purely operator off his own system. arrogance. <laughs> yes, I helped build and design. <laughs> Captain, if you are implying that I should stay behind. Tamar, we may need your technical assistance should things get unfriendly, unpredictable. But my father. Classic fucking Spock. Should things get unfriendly. I will remain in constant. I'll be contact. here checking Thank out you. your butt Captain up close. What are you doing? <laughs> yeah, what is Back happening you. here? Do you have a high fiber diet? It smells. Yeah, whoa! Spock, where are you? Ugh. I can make this right. Really? <laughs> oh shit! Oh, you can! No problem. Okay, okay, maybe a little problem. Oh yeah. I can find a less adventurous solution. Ah, Spock. <laughs> Fuck you, Spock. Thanks. A little forethought next time, and there will be no need for you some fucking captain. forethought. How about I shoot you in the eye socket, jerk? Yeah. Can I lock this on Sorry. Spock? Oh, I tried to lock it. I didn't mean it to get him. aggressive. Can we eject him out into the into the void? Got him. Oh. Got to make sure everyone's okay. That'd be great. This cutscene goes to like Kirk grabbing Spock by the collar and taking him really close to one of these corpses and being like, "If you back talk me again, <laughs> this will be you. Do you understand, essay?" <laughs> and then just like a little kiss on the cheek. Yes. Yeah, exactly. Like a weirdly gingerly kiss. <laughs> Oh. And then before the camera breaks, just a. <laughs> <laughs> oh, is this a new gun? What is this? Oh, no. it's oh. it's actually nothing. It's a scientific data pad, third. Oh shit! Oh, this guy's crazy. He's infected I can tell already. Yeah. Nah, he's fine. Uh, he's a reptilian. You better fight. Spock, save me! Oh, takedown? You know it. Oh. Wow. All right, we got him. We got him. Whoa! Yeah, tricord it. We were able to spare that individual's life. Me too. Let's keep it that way. By the way, Josh, uh, I take back everything I just said about Spock. He just saved your ass. Nah, I doubt it. I tried to scan it. I think he's been poisoned. You think he's been poisoned? Toxins in the adrenal glands and bloodstream. Ew. Glands. Ugh. Research? No, thank Ugh. you. Well. Yeah, just all I needed to hear was gland infection, and it's like, ugh. <laughs> I can upgrade. Can someone give me some antibiotics. What? I can upgrade my... For some reason, for a second, I thought this was like a box of tissues. It's like, that's an odd <laughs> thing to have to be able to upgrade. <laughs> you can upgrade your cleanliness? I guess. Uh, no, that was a box of tissues. Use your use on your ally? Nope, not getting that. Can't afford Spock's that. Spock's got to suffer. <laughs> not, how much XP it. do you got? How much? Oh, you got 400? I weak. have 400 whole. What are you, a child? Firing stabilizer. Increases accuracy for both fire. Yeah, okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. We'll do it. Not getting anything for Spock, Boom. though. Spock, come here. No. No. Let me look at your ass, at least. Don't, don't, don't. <sighs> God. Classic Spock. Ain't no ass like a motherfucking Vulcan ass. Oh. <laughs> Tap three and four to equip grenades. Grenades? I have grenades? I think that message has yes. come up a lot of time. Oh boy. <gasps> you can always tell because they have the uh, the weird <laughs> nut shot on their back. <laughs> <laughs> Did Slimer just do something on your back? Oh. Oh. Uh, speaking of sliming. Ugh. Eh. Oh. Wait. Wow. Do you see this sort of like dead-eyed face that Kirk had? It's like what he lives for. We need a code. A 
He's beyond having emotional sensitivity to these infected weaklings. This is great. This is how people take care of business. TCB, Kirk! T <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Listen up, Spock. You might learn something. If I gotta get through this door. Fuck. So you gotta... Wait, Vulcan mind melds. Wait. It's Vulcan. Vulcan mind melds. Spock can... is gonna... You gotta mind meld. Have Spock, Spock mind meld this dead mind guy. Mind meld this shit. Mind meld that guy or what? Are you sure you want to touch Yeah! Oh, shit, yeah. Uh, Spock, this is wildly. That's what. That's why you don't want people to know about it. This before. His mind has been corrupted. What? I don't care. Did you get the codes or not? What gave it away, Spock? His fucking lava skin. Everything all right? Yeah, just some Vulcan problems. Oh shit, Kirk, that's some fucking racist ass shit. What could be through this door? We're gonna have to find out next time.